In today's Max Minute, many are holding out hope for a vaccine to fight the coronavirus. But now there's concern that one may never be developed. So could treatment be the answer? Here's Dr. Max Gomez. As a COVID-19 pandemic moves into its third month, millions around the globe have hung their hopes for an end to the disease on a vaccine. Yet there's a growing number of experts who say that hope and the millions in research funds dedicated for a vaccine may be misplaced. They point out that there has never been a successful vaccine against any coronavirus, not SARS, MERS, or common cold coronas. An envoy from the World Health Organization, who's a professor of global health at Imperial College London, told CNN that a COVID-19 vaccine may never be developed. Then there are the issues of cost and whether billions of people across the globe should be vaccinated when the vast majority of people infected with this coronavirus survive with manageable, minimal, or no symptoms at all. A growing number of doctors now argue that we should be spending far more on developing effective treatments for COVID-19. Remdesivir is an admittedly minor example of a treatment. And despite conflicting study results, hydroxychloroquine in combination with other drugs may also be effective. Like AIDS, which after decades still has no vaccine, a cocktail of drugs that inhibit coronavirus replication may be a much more targeted therapy or immunotherapy to induce the body's own defenses to overcome the virus. This would allow for a far more targeted therapeutic approach treating only those who get sick rather than vaccinating the entire global population. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News.